evidence is pretty conclusive. But, uh, the vice president continued to assert a connection between al-Qaeda and Iraq. But the CIA kept saying it wasn't true. We said in that time frame that we had no evidence linking Iraq to al-Qaeda and to those attacks. Tenet had even ordered a massive agency search for any connection. Tenet, to his credit, uh, had us uh, go back 10 years in the agency's records and look and see what we knew about Iraq and al-Qaeda. And I was available at the time, and I led the effort. And we went back 10 years. We examined about 20,000 documents, probably something in, along the line of 75,000 pages of information. And there was no connection between Iraq and Saddam. He saw that as his job. And he told the president, here's what I think. And the president didn't like it, fine. But he, it, I never saw him hold back on what I knew. He told him everything that I knew, he told the president. Like what? Uh, th things that were going on. Uh, here's, uh, it's the al-Qaeda in Afghanistan. Uh, it's not the Iraqis. It's not the Iranians. Boom, just like that. So from the very beginning, he right from it's al-Qaeda. It's al-Qaeda in Afghanistan. And Bush is hearing that. Yep. He was hearing that? Colonel Mustard in the library with the candlestick. I mean, that, here it is. Yeah. Simply stated, there is no doubt that Saddam Hussein now has weapons of mass destruction. There is no doubt that he is amassing them to use against our friends, against our allies, and against us. And there is no doubt that his aggressive regional ambition... Congress would soon have to vote on the war. ...that Saddam has resumed his efforts to acquire nuclear weapons. But much of what they knew came from Cheney on television. They brought in George Tenet. We had a meeting of the Senate Intelligence Committee, a closed meeting with Director Tenet, and several of us asked him, what did the National Intelligence Estimate say about this issue? The National Intelligence Estimate, the NIE, is the highest level document generated by the intelligence agencies. The NIE was kept in a locked room where Congress could read it. But few did. In mid-October, they voted overwhelmingly in favor of the Iraqi war resolution. And one of the surprising things about it was it was of a very high production level. Graphs, photographs in color. Uh, it, it was an advocacy piece. What does it say to you? Well, it says to me that the decision had been made that we're going to go to war with Iraq, all of this other was just window dressing, uh, and that the intelligence community was being used uh, as almost a public relations operation to validate the war against Saddam Hussein. 